I remember I was in your place way back when I first got started in messaging people and seeing if there was a need for my business or not. I was met with a lot of resistance. I was met with some real nasty kind of responses like, oh, you don't have anything that I already have and you got nothing. Oh, who's going to want to listen to you? You're a joke. And I got a lot of mean, nasty kind of replies. And you know what that did to me in the very beginning? It made me not want to message people because I felt like I got rejected. And what I learned from Jeffrey Combs is it's not so much that people reject you. Sometimes people are not interested in connecting with you or they're just not simply interested in your offer. But don't take it personal. A lot of times people take it personal when they get rejected. Like let's say, for example, in Messenger. And with my case, when I was getting rejected by other people, you got to keep in mind that not everybody is for you. And that's okay. It's okay that there's going to be people out there that you're going to talk to that are going to be real nasty. They're going to be complete jackasses for a blunt way of putting it. But there are those out there who are looking for answers to their problems, and they're going to be willing to join you for whatever it is that you sell. But first, you got to have that human to human interaction, and you got to find out if whoever you're talking to has a need for whatever product or service you're selling. That's how you're going to get leads. That's how you're going to close sales. That's how I did it. I managed to get my first about $300 on social media because I followed this formula. I was able to generate a few leads and I was able to convert those leads into sales. But that was all because I mastered the art of asking and I continue to build this skill set. So, mind you, I'm still working on sharpening the skill set. And I'm continuing to go forward. I'm continuing to get better at my craft. But Genesis, what you want to do when you're faced with situations like this in which you're feeling frustrated and you're seeing that nobody wants to join your business, well, you got to ask yourself something. You, first of all, you got to look at the way that you're talking to people. Are you going straight into the pitch? Or are you having a human-to-human -human conversation first? Are you having a mindset issue? Are you expecting everybody that you talk to to join your business? Because if you're having that mindset trouble, then you got to get out of it. In fact, what I recommend that you do is don't hard sell to people. Don't outright pitch to them or don't be making it obvious that you're desperate to make that sale. Focus on having that human to human interaction. And I promise you that if you do just that, you're going to be surprised at how people will talk their way into your business when you ask the right questions. And remember, even when you follow all of this, as Jeffrey Combs puts it, you can't win them all. It's okay that not everybody is for you. What you want to do is keep going and master the art of asking so that you can get better at asking better questions, having better conversations that lead to them becoming a lead and thus them close, being closed into a sale.